Welcome to the F1 Pneumatic Release Single Interlock System Startup Scenario. In this scenario, we are going through the steps of placing an F1 Single Interlock Free Action System equipped with a pneumatic release into service. Open the priming valve to establish water pressure in the prime chamber. Notice that there are two air maintenance device assemblies here. We can start introducing air to the dry pilot line by opening the air bypass valve on the air maintenance device that leads to the dry pilot line. Once the release line air pressure is within 5 psi of your target air pressure, close the air bypass valve and open the ball valve below the air maintenance device to finish filling the release system. After re-establishing air pressure in the release system, the pneumatic actuator will set, stopping the flow of prime water to the drain and allowing water pressure in the prime chamber to build. Locate the air maintenance device that connects to the sprinkler piping and open the air bypass valve. Once the sprinkler piping air pressure is within 5 psi of your target air pressure, Close the air bypass valve and open the ball valve below the air maintenance device to finish filling the piping system. Next, partially open the flow test valve. Verify water pressure has been established in the prime chamber. Slightly open the water supply control valve and begin introducing water into the system. Open the auxiliary drain and verify that there is no water flow. Now close the auxiliary drain. Once flow has been established, close the flow test valve. Now fully open the water supply control valve. Verify that all trim valves are in their normal operating position. After the system water pressure is restored, any alarm panels that were activated will need to be reset to clear any active alarms. Excellent! The system has been placed into service.